발사. 6. It's just a matter of days. This missile capable frigate will dock on our naval base. I am very excited on this one. Finally, we have a true firepower of a frigate ship in our inventory. This is Jose Rizal Frigate FF-150 as the lead ship of its class. By late of this month, May 23, 2020, she will coming home. In this video, let's talk about how powerful this ship is, from its armaments to its radars. So buckle up and let's start. Last May 1st of 2018, South Korean shipbuilder Hyundai Heavy Industries starts building the two hulls of BRP Jose Rizal FF-150 and BRP Antonio Luna FF-151. This comes after the months of negotiations and reviews agreed between the Department of National Defense and Hyundai Heavy Industries. The contract price approximately 16 billions. The design of the ship will be the first for the Philippine Navy to have a hull reduces radar cross-section. This is because of a stealthy design of the ship. This is a trend to a modern warship where the superstructure blends with the ship hulls with degree of inclination. The ship having a dimension of 107 meters length and 13 meters on its is beam. An endurance of 4,500 nautical miles at 15 knots. It has a top speed of 25 knots. Now let's go to its armaments. Some say it's a downgraded frigate but for me it is a descent frigate which something that we, Filipino must be proud of. It is great addition arsenal to the Navy regardless the issues. I know you guys are also excited to see this ship in our waters. The primary gun is Otto Malara 76mm Super Rapid Naval Gun. It can engage both air and surface targets at rate of 100 per minute. It has a range of about 20 km defense of various ammunition. ASEL SAN Smash 30mm MK. 44 Bushmaster 2 Cannon serve as secondary gun system. Smash configurations incorporate advanced features as remote operation, built-in electro-optic sensor system and or separate electro-optic fire control system for autonomous operation, day and night operation, stabilized turret, automatic target tracking. The missile system for this ship is a milestone to our Philippine Navy. The first ship armed with anti-ship cruise missile. The frigate will be fitted of SSM-700 KC Star anti-ship missile. It is a ship-launched sea-skimming surface-to-surface anti-ship cruise missile developed by the South Korean. An operational range of 150 km. The ship has 8-cell vertical launching system. This will add ship's firepower ranging from defense to offense. Anti-ship to anti-aircraft defend. Vertical launch Tomahawk is one of the famous example of this one. The ship is fitted a close-in weapon system, a point defense weapon system for detecting and destroying short-range incoming missiles and enemy aircraft which have penetrated the outer defenses. There are two contender, Phalanx and Sea Ram. C, J plus S triple torpedo launcher is also seen in this frigate. The ship will obtain two units of these triple launchers where it will install on both port and starboard sides of the ship in front of rigid hull inflatable boats. I almost forgot. MBDA Simbad remote control launcher also exist. This launcher will be fitted with Mistral missiles. This weapon is also intended for last line of defense. A short air defense missile system and has range of up to 6 kilometers. These decoy launching system is a self-protection solution that keeps the ships and its crew safe from coordinated attacks ranging from multiple missile barrage and incoming torpedo. This is the summary of the radars and sensors of this ship. Elbit Elizra NS 9003 Aquamarine ASM. Designed as early warning sensor pertaining to ship self-defense specially when it's related to electronic warfare. Harris Model 997 hull-mounted sonar. Towed array sonar. 
Kelvin Hughes Sharpi X and S band navigational radar. Leonardo NA25X fire control radar. Safran Paseo NS electro optical tracking system, and the controversial Hanwha System Naval Shield Baseline 2 integrated combat management system. On November 2019, the second frigate launched in Ulsan, South Korea. It is a BRP Antonio Luna, a sister ship of BRP Jose Rizal. So, what can say? Just comment below. That's it, it's a wrap.